Yo, it's Worm. Today I'm going to show you how to get a crown win using a new explosive repeater rifle. We're going to land just outside Steamy Springs where the bridge is. There is an NPC who's selling the new rifle for 250 gold. Once you get that rifle, we then need to talk about organs. There are some new ones in the game. First one you need, heavy headshots. Weapons using heavy ammo will increase headshot damage. Bloodhounds, enemies will be hit by your rifle were marked and heavy ammo acquired. Instantly gain heavy ammo and additional heavy ammo when opening ammo crates. Okay, second augment. We're now going to try to find one of the three that we marked. Uh, I'm going to try to get Bloodhound. There you go, Bloodhound. Okay, a little bit of advice, when you use the rifle, don't treat it like a shotgun. It's basically a long range weapon. So why not shoot from distance, but try to be more vital than to spray. Sweet. Thanks to the crown, boys. Okay, remember, when you're using the rifle, try to switch to your AR, because your AR can do fatal damage, and then switch back, because you know you're going to get 70 plus damage with it, so you can knock people quicker. Now impulse on the other player and kill him quickly as you can before he gets revived. He's trying to open one of these caches for a slurp, but we don't have enough time for that. So we're going to go for his loot quickly. He's got some gauntlets. We're going to carry that because we've got no movement. This is going to come handy later on in the game. Try and keep an eye on where the storm is because you will start ticking for a large amount. I'm now going to use this motorbike and I'm going to try to get to the NPC just outside the Citadel. Before I get the NPC, I'm going to try to kill this guy. I got the height and he's not moving. Look at this. This is an easy kill. Boom. He's probably going to be stuck on the roof, so we're going to have to try to spray him down and then we're going to hire him. There are five players left, including me. He's going to help me stay alive. Okay, there's some guys in front of me. I'm going to start to spray them. 
see they're now focused on me. My NPC is just going to spray them. It's going to give me an opportunity to run away. Because I picked up the gauntlets earlier, the gauntlets are going to be quite vital for me to like get round the edge of the map without being seen. Okay, we're down to three players. There's one in front of me. I'm going to try to spray him. Because i got the Bloodhound, I know where he is. Unfortunately, his teammate is to the left of him. He's creeping around. And we need now need to find out where the other guy is. So we can either wait for them to kill him, or we can try to kill him ourselves. So they killed him for me. So it's now me against them two. They've also got an NPC, so technically it's three against one. I have to be very careful that this tree doesn't fall on me as well. Okay, we're going to use the gauntlets to go like away and try to get a little bit more of a safe gap. We can then use the rifle after that and then see what we can do. And there you go, an easy crown win. Thanks for watching guys.